All I'm going to say is from the get-go, I have been a Rihanna fan. Is she your number one? Is she your favorite? Oh, I mean, yeah. Selena Gomez may be one of the biggest pop stars in the world, but she still fangirls over her faves like the rest of us. The Lose You to Love Me singer revealed to Zayn Lowe on Apple Music's Beats One Radio that Rihanna is her number one artist, and she's been on board since the very beginning. All I'm going to say is, from the get-go, I have been a Rihanna fan. SOS to now. So there isn't any real moment that, like, it isn't gold. Though Selena said bad gal Riri won her over with her first hit single more than a decade ago, her more recent tracks have a meaningful impact too, including one which she believes is already a classic. Love on the Brain, and when she performed that live, I think that's one of the greatest songs of our time. I just think that the way she sings that song, it just takes me to another place. It's not just about the music though. Selena even shared that she has some Rihanna memorabilia at home, which she joked isn't always the best thing to have on display if a date comes over. Is she your number one? Is she your favorite? Oh, I mean, yeah. <laughs> yes, I have a whole book in there dedicated to Rihanna in my living room. What? What is that? The Rihanna picture book. Right, right. And it's not a good idea to have around when you want guys there, but oh well. <laughs> Selena is never shy about shouting out her fellow A-listers for a job well done. She also praised pal Taylor Swift as one of our greatest songwriters and reflected on how Billie Eilish's Everything I Wanted left her in tears because she can relate to the teen's journey to fame at an early age, saying, quote, When I heard that song, I just sobbed because I've been doing this for so long, and it's like, damn, that's so true. She deserved every single thing that she got and has. She's an amazing, amazing artist. So what's next for Selena? The 27-year-old's first studio album in four years, Rare, just dropped in January and shot to the top of the charts, but she's already making new music in quarantine, telling Zayn that she's building a social distancing-friendly studio setup at home and is so excited to start experimenting. And we can't wait to hear what's on the way.